what I should have done is listen to my mother. I don't know why I thought this would ever be a good idea. And I've lived with plenty of assholes in my time, but I have never encountered anyone as selfish as you two shitheads. Can I ever tell you how I won? You leave the milk out of the fridge, you leave the front door open all night. You accidentally killed three of my cats. Hey, only two of them were accidents. You make excuses for not paying rent. My Dolomite account is overdrawn. Oh, I don't want to hear it, Dane. Not the loot. Come on, Greta, we're not that bad. Yes, you are, Todd. The other day you used my washing machine to make jelly. Before you moved in, we didn't know we had a washing machine. Living in this house with you two has been the single worst experience of my life. Well, now that old what's-her-name's gone, I guess we've got to find a new housemate. Where'd you say you're from? Uh, Malaysia. Malaysia. Is that in Asia? Or is it a... Yeah, sure. Such a fascinating people. Well, this is it. Uh, your Sky b, &B profile said that this would be fully furnished. Yeah. Well, just leave you to get settled in and if you need anything at all, don't ask me. Call me. Wow, so far Australia is really, really bad. <sighs> oh! What? This is how I sleep. You're not sleeping now. No one in the suburb is sleeping now because your little mate is in there drilling for oil. Hey, can you guys keep it down? Did you turn our spare room into a laundromat? No. No, I reckon you did. You've lived here for like 18 hours. All right, look, in two weeks, this laundromat will have generated enough revenue to support me for my entire business degree. But more importantly, why is one of you naked? It's so steamy. I kind of like it. All right, hey, check your rules. No way in your profile does it say no laundromats. Can you grubs do some laundry or get the fuck out? All right, hey, look, so thanks so much for coming to uh, Ronnie's Laundromat for uh, all your laundry needs. Uh, Remember to follow us on Twitter and Instagram. Goodbye. Resident coming through. Get your bloody jocks out of my face, mate. Oh, God, this is like a bloody low brick convention in here. Get out. The steam's getting worse. Mm. My delicate little hands are pruning up. This Ronnie guy is the worst. Who's that up? Mm. Wait. I better get to work. <laughs> wait, 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 who gave you a job? Ronnie did. I work at his laundromat now. What? Yeah, we're pretty slammed. Won't be home for dinner. <laughs> Excuse me. this. I just washed these clothes here at Ronnie's laundromat and they're still filthy. Whoa, whoa, whoa. What's happening? A little thing called the competitive marketplace. You certainly never get this kind of shoddy service over at Todd's laundromat, handily located just down the hallway. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, bet they never taught you this in your little business course. Of course they did. It's a business course. This is exactly what they teach you in business course. Hey, Dane. Tell Ronnie to shove it and come work for me. Oh, I don't know. I, I might just stay here. I'm climbing the ladder real quickly. <laughs> Wait, is this shit? Did you cover yourself in actual human feces for this? Oh, no. I'm not giving up my business secrets that easily. Anyway, chaps, that's enough corporate chit-chat for one day. I've got a successful laundromat to run. Hey, uh, keep folding the towel. Uh, yes, Mr. Ronnie. See guys, who needs those newfangled washing machines when you've got this sturdy, reliable washing board? You've been washing those same jocks for 45 minutes. This is the worst laundromat ever. I'm going back to Ronnie's. Ah, oh, my old nemesis. 
come to see how a real laundromat's run, have we? No. This is my lawyer, Greta Andrews. Wait, Greta that used to live here? <laughs> You're a lawyer? Yes, Todd. I've represented you in court mm. multiple times. Mm. I'm here to inform you that the name Todd's Laundromat is in direct copyright violation to Ronnie's Laundromat. My client has trademarked the term laundromat and is entitled to its exclusive use in the walls of this house. Oh, but... Sorry, I thought you'd cut in there. I've, I've got nothing. Disgusting. Dane, wait. Don't let them do this to me. You've got to get out of that laundromat. Look at what the steam's done to your skin. Hey, great work today, Dane. Let's go get some jelly. You want some jelly? You have one hour to vacate this room. Where will I sleep? Where will I sleep? What do you want? Shouldn't you be handing out detergent at Ronnie's? Mr. Ronnie fired me. All the machines broke because they put marbles in them. Oh, Dane. You sabotaged Ronnie's laundromat for me? No, I just wanted to see what would happen. You did do it for me! Anyway, Ronnie took over my room and set up a dry cleaning business in there, so do you mind if I sleep here until he moves out? Sure, pal. Uh, uh, <laughs> well, I think we can agree we need to update our profile. <laughs> you said it. Definitely no more laundromats. Wait, what was yours?